Bluetooth. What's poppin' Tan? I'm the pasta Tan. Hey, I'm just really nigga rich. Make it splash, make it splash. But before I get you drip, I just got one question. Bitch! Can you make a dip? Uh, me? How you make it dip? What's poppin' Tan? I'm the pasta Tan. All these ends, why you motherfuckers got to be? Eat a box or something. I used to touch a little watch with some rocks or something. Show me how you make it dip. 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 What's a popping tin? I know it's been a minute since you've seen me, the Naomi Amber on your screen, but she's back and she's better. You don't even know how to make a YouTube video anymore. We still on the road to 10K and we're so close. So housekeeping rules, a little bit of housekeeping. Um, before we even get started, before we even get into the nitty gritty, I'm gonna need you to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel because this year gonna be my year. I'm not gonna stop saying it until my year come. I'm not gonna stop saying it. This year is gonna be my year. It's gonna be my year for my YouTube channel. I just, I just have a feeling. You know when you just have that feeling in your like, it's in my, it's, it's all up in here. Like I took a little break from YouTube during the holidays to you know spend time with my family, you know normal things. But I also wanted to get ready for the new year and figure out how I wanted to amp up my channel. Like, hauls are cute and all, but I really wanted to spice it up and do something different instead of just showing you guys clothes because I feel like I could do more. Like, I'm better than that. So, I'm still going to be doing hauls, but I'm going to add some little twists here and there to help you guys style clothes and just make it more fun because hauls are fun for me. Like, I love dressing up. I love getting cute, but it was getting redundant. So, we needed to... One, two, three, let's switch this up. And that's what we're going to be doing today, so I'm so excited. This is going to be a part of a few different series that are going to be on my channel in terms of fashion and styling and all that good stuff, but I don't want to keep chatting because I've taken a long break. I know you guys are just ready to see the day on clothes. Like, girl, get on with it. What is what is this? What do you got for us? Come on, give it to us. Give, give, it, give it to us. So this video is going to be a Pinterest recreation video. So I'm going to recreate some different outfits that I found on Pinterest featuring Shein. So all the outfits that I'm recreating, I found from Shein. As you know, Shein is a very affordable site. So this is a great way to kick it off. If you're a one of those people that New Year's resolution was to amp up your style, new wardrobe, Shein is a place to start because their stuff is really affordable and you can find great cute fits, a lot of good staples, a lot of good basics, but I am chatting too much. So let's just get right into the video. So for the first Pinterest fit, this is the outfit that I'll be recreating and it's the outfit that I have on currently right now for this video. And I'm just going to look at my phone in the picture for reference to see if we nailed it. And I'm gonna rate this from a one to a 10 as to like how good I like hit this on the nail. So it's a picture of Diara and she's wearing a brown Sherpa jacket with a black crop top and ripped up, um, ripped up wide leg jeans and some Air Jordan, some red Air Jordan 1s they look like. So this is the fit that I created from Shein. I got this um, Sherpa jacket, pretty similar to the one that she had in the picture. I think hers was just a little bit darker, like it had um, more darker accents for the jacket. Um, but I really do like this jacket. I would recommend sizing up because it, um, it's not that it's small in my arms, but if you want that oversized look, definitely recommend sizing up. If not, you don't have to. <laughs> um, and then I just got this crop top from Shein. This was in a couple hauls ago, probably from like the summer, but definitely still works for this fit. And then the jeans, I will show you guys in the try on portion. These jeans, I got them from Zara, I believe. Um, so these are not from Shein, but I will definitely link down below a similar pair. And also, she did have like a brown cylindrical bag in the picture, but I don't have a brown one. I only have a black one, but I do have my brown tail feezy this is a black owned luxury bag brand if you guys are unfamiliar with it um and these restock every week um in different colors and they're really really hard to get your fingers on so turn on the notifications honey on the website and i'll link that down below as well she also had red air jordan ones in the picture but um i don't have those but i do have some white air force ones which i think would go cute with this outfit too um but currently i am wearing it and i styled it with my converse high run sneakers so i thought the brown and the shoe looked really nice but i'll show you guys both how they look in the try on portion and what do you guys think what's your rating I'm going to rate this in terms of like nailing it I'm gonna rate it 
let's give it like a let's give it an eight i'm gonna give it an eight because it's cute like even though i didn't nail it it's always okay to switch something up to fit your style and to fit the fit that you are wearing you don't have to hit it exactly to the t but in terms of me recreating this outfit i think i'm gonna give myself an eight because we hit it we hit it so now we're on outfit number two this is the outfit that i'll be recreating for this fit i purchased a long sleeve scoop neck um jumpsuit from shein it is ribbed so it's perfect because it's not see-through it is not skin tight to my body like i'm not thick like it doesn't like form to my body but I made it work. I mean, you y'all know me. I'll make some work. But I really do like this piece. It was really, really inexpensive and it's good quality. She's wearing a square cylindrical bag and she's also wearing these. I think these are called Rick Owens. I'm not too sure. But Converse, actually, I just got a new pair of Converse's and they're very, very similar. Very, very similar to that pair that she's wearing in the photo. And this is what I'm going to pair this with and I'll show you guys what it looks like on the side. But they're just these lugged Converse's and these are so cute. They also have them in white. I think I'm going to run and get the white too. But they didn't have it in store when I was shopping. But these are so, so nice. I think these are a great alternative to like my Dr. Martens and like that kind of grunge style. So... Highly, highly looking forward to showing you guys what this looks like. And then this is the bag that I'm going to pair with it to match with what she has going on. So I'm going to show you guys what it looks like and where I'm going to rate this. Let's see. What, what are we going to get this on a scale of 1 to 10? I'm going to give this a 9. I'm going to give this a, I'm gonna give this a 9. Actually, I'm going to give it a 10 because it is, this is basically it. Like... This is basically the fit. So I'm going to give it a 10. And let's move on to the next outfit. So this next fit is also Diara. Surprise, surprise. Like, she'd be dressing, okay? So I'm not surprised that she's all over Pinterest. But in this outfit, she has on this racer back black bodysuit and some leather pants. And then she also has on what looks like Yeezys. I don't have Yeezys, but I will show you guys what I came up with. <laughs> Basically, I have this black um racer back bodysuit i didn't purchase one from shein but i know that they have them so i will link a similar one from shein down below but this is a black bodysuit from misguided and it's very similar to the one that dr was wearing in the photo and then i also got these this is this is a showstopper and i was very very surprised and very highly pleased with how this fits me but it's just these um ruched leather pants i know it's kind of scary right now but wait till you guys see me try it on and show you guys the whole full fit relax <laughs> but um and it looks so small but it really does have a good stretch a good amount of stretch in it um but it's just these ruched leather pants and they go all the way down for me i know finding like pants that fit you lengthwise is an issue really really hype i found these um this gem and it was really really affordable so if they have like a brown i'm gonna definitely go back and go get it on the site over this fit i'm going to pair it with my um Air Force Ones. Um, I don't remember what name these are, but they're kind of beige. Just picking that up, but they're kind of beige and they have like black accents, so I think that'll bring out the black in the whole outfit. And let's see what bag we can pair this with, just to add some spice. Hmm. Let's see how it looks with this bag. Let's see how it looks with this bag, and I'm gonna try some other bags in the try on portion and see what we think. But she didn't. She didn't have a bag in the picture, but I think that I'm going to give this outfit a 10 because I hit both of those outfits on the nail, okay? Period. So, for the next outfit, the girl is wearing a satin, like, bandeau wrap top with um, these ripped jeans, kind of similar to the first jeans. Um, wide leg, and she's wearing, it looks like some New Balances or something like that. Um, so, this is what I came up with. She and, on their website, they had this... I can't afford Chanel, so um, I got this like black satin, very similar shape, very, very similar structure to the Chanel one in the picture. Um, but it's black and satin. It didn't have, doesn't have like any white in it or anything. But same, similar kind of idea. You already know the vibes. You know what's going on. Um, but yeah, this is really, really nice. I think I got it in a small, but you can definitely get away with getting in an extra small if you're my size. Um, not to say that's big or anything, but I'm just saying like. You got all this to work with, so definitely not a problem if you got a size lower. And then I'm just going to pair it with jeans. They are ripped, um, and I'm going to show you guys what they look like, and I'm going to pair them with my white Air Force Ones that I showed you guys earlier. 
and this is what it looks like all together i'm going to rate this outfit i'm gonna say let's give it an 8.7 because i couldn't find like a white and black satin top so i didn't hit it exactly on the nail and i don't have any dad shoes similar to the ones that she's wearing in the picture but it's cute it's still cute i don't care what y'all say <laughs> so let's move on to the next outfit so here is the next outfit um, I guess I saved the worst for last. <laughs> this outfit is basically a brown, like, monochromatic look that I saw on Pinterest. And I was really, really excited because I was like, wow, this is kind of cute. It's kind of a banger. But, <laughs> sadly, this stuff did not fit and it doesn't look the way that I wanted it to look. But I'm gonna just let y'all see in the try-on portion. So, I got this mock neck bodysuit and it's also open back as well so i don't think in the picture she had an open back top but this is the closest thing that i could find and the camera is picking up very caramelly but it's definitely more brown and it's a darker deeper brown in person but i got it to pair with these leather pants and i was so excited for these i was so hyped for them especially after trying on the black leather pants i was like okay so this is going to be a banger put these on <laughs> This is what the pants look like. They're really, really nice. Um, if you're a sh if you're a little bit shorter than me, then these will probably fit you lengthwise. But these do not fit me lengthwise at all, and they do not fit around my waist. And I was really, really excited. And I was going to pair them with these heels that I also got from Shein. And they're just these clear um, nude heels, and they're kind of similar to the ones that the girl had in the outfit. And I was also going to pair with this bag from Shein. Um, and complete the whole look in terms of like me picking out the right pieces like having the right idea I'm gonna give myself a 10 but in terms of execution we're gonna give ourselves like a like a four five <laughs> three <laughs> because it just doesn't look right at all and you guys will see in the trial portion so that this haul is for not I do want to show you guys the rest of the things that I got off of Shein to style personally that I think will be really really cute and I'm gonna show you guys how I style them on the side as well we just have this Sherpa gray trench coat I think I got this in a medium but I honestly could have gotten an extra large like I really think that the arms are a little bit high up on me personally um but the it's really really nice I'm gonna show you guys how I styled it I styled it with my Uggs that I got for Christmas the next item that I got from Shein is just this brown dress it's like this color block dress and I think I got this in a, in a small extra small um it is very short <laughs> very very short but I plan on pairing this with some cream boots and then also this white Sherpa trench coat this cream Sherpa trench coat that I got from H&M but Shein has a very similar very similar jackets on their website to match with the cream and this dress and I'll link a similar coat to that one in the description and i'm gonna show you guys the heels as well and here are the heels <laughs> they're from zara i still have yet to wear them because i have not found an outfit to go so hopefully that this outfit is like chef's kiss and i really do like so, it this is the next item that i got it's just this sherpa lined leather moto jacket and it's coming up white on camera but it's definitely a cream and you guys will see like the true color in the triumph portion but i was so hyped so hyped for this jacket um and i just plan on wearing it with you know like a black jumpsuit and you know some white boots like you know some real calm real chill real calm real chill but it does not fit my arms like all the way like i can get away with it but i hate getting away with clothes because then you have to mess around with it when you're wearing them but i can definitely get away with it like for a picture or something but i might end up selling this because it does not fit your girl but it's so so cute um and if i do sell it i do sell clothes on my poshmark so if you guys aren't following me on my poshmark the link is always in the description under shop my closet so that completes the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I know it's a little bit different from my typical hauls and that's just what the vibe is going to be for the rest of the year. We're going to do something different. We're going to switch it up. And I hope you guys are ready for more Pinterest recreation videos. Give this a thumbs up if you liked it. Make sure you subscribe. And I guess that's it.